the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello, Gamer Nom is back. Wait, 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 Gamer Nom. In the title, it says Love Fruit, right? But why are you using the Falcon Fruit? Guys, I'm just enjoying it because I'm gonna eat another fruit again. If you remember, we showcased lots of fruits since yesterday. So I'm just enjoying it. Okay, so now guys, we're gonna showcase the love fruit and I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. This is the fruit of Boa Hancock, right? One of the ex Shichibu guys in One Piece if you're watching the anime. So we're gonna eat it guys and we're gonna level up. But we only need 100 mastery to unlock all the skills. We have a total of 4 skills and for the first skill we already have the Mellowing Heart. Guys, this fruit so far is one of the best for me. Better than Diamond, Kilo, and Falcon. So here's the first skill again. The Mellow Heart, a mid-range attack. And as long as their enemies is within range, you can damage them. There you go. But guys, this is not a Logia fruit, so you still need to dodge and lure your enemies. But even though we died, we have reached Mastery 31, which means we have unlocked the second skill, the Arrow of Imprisonment. This is a long range attack. There you go. So let's check it out. Guys, in terms of damage, if you were able to hit your enemy with this, I think this is the strongest one in all of the four skills. So again, let's lure the enemy and let's try it out. Okay, so make sure you aim properly. There you go, not bad. Now guys, I think we can level up faster because we have two skills that are both damaging. So I think this will be faster. There you go. Next skill will be unlocked at Mastery 50. There you go, we've already reached 49. And 50. Okay, 50. So guys, check it out. Both skills has a stun. So, for our third skill, we have the Irresistible Attraction. Guys, this skill really looks cool. Again, for all the skills, for a second, your enemies will turn into stone. Check that out, guys. It really looks cool. Your enemies turn to stone. Trademark of Boa Hancock. There you go. Okay. So now, the first skill is a mid-range, right? Second skill, long-range. This one is an AoE. Not compared to the first two skills, anyone that's around you will be damaged in a certain range. Okay, so we've reached Mastery 89. Really fast, right? Yeah, guys, this is really fast comparing it to Diamond, the Kilo, and the Falcon. There you go. Okay, 97, last 3, 98, 99, okay, last one. First skill, second skill. Okay, 100 guys, mastery. We finally unlocked the last skill, the scented kicks. Let's check it out. If you're doing PvP or boss fights, I think this is the best skill to initiate. Your attacks, there you go. And use your first skill, X skill, or maybe use your C skill. I don't know, guys. It's, it depends to you. I'm just showcasing it. Okay, so now, guys, again, we have first skill, mid range, second skill. Uh, long range, third skill, AOE around you guys. Check it out. It's very nice to see. And if you want to defeat someone fast, you can use your scented kicks. Okay, so that's it for the skills. Now we're gonna check it with the. We're gonna check the damage. So we're gonna do a friendly PvP with my brother. Guys, the enemy that we're fighting has 500 defense. Surprisingly, the damage of the first skill is kind of high. Check it out. Almost dead. For the range, guys, check this out. This is the range, maximum range. So if in case you want to attack your enemy, use your second skill, okay? If you're within this range, this one, okay? But the range of the second skill is not unlimited, guys. I'm gonna show it to you. This is the maximal range, I guess. Okay, see that. Okay, so let's defeat him and let's start another round of friendly PvP. Okay, so here you are. Okay, so we're still within range. But for the maximum range, guys, I guess, hmm, from here you won't be able to hit your enemy. Now let's check it out. Let's try it. Okay, check the cursor. We're pointing. Okay. So according to my brother, the arrows just passed by, but there are no damage. So it indicates that that's way beyond its range. 
Okay, so now C skill. There's his double attraction. Let's check it out. Again, just like the first skill, it's a short to mid-range type of attack. So again, even though you're not facing, you can damage your enemy. There you go. Guys, I really love the stone effect. Let's check it out again. Okay. Let's say your enemy was able to get near you. You don't have observation hockey. You can use that, right? Enemy will turn to stone and you can run. <laughs> yes, but if you're fighting a light fruit, I doubt if you can run with that. Okay, so that is the C skill. Last up, our scented kicks. But guys, if you want to watch or know more about the diamond fruit, I just posted a video of this. This is one of the skills, the solar flare. Check my video out. So guys, for our last skill again, the scented kicks. There you go. This is a single target skill. You can use this to initiate your combo or attack your enemy. Check it out. And not just that, I'm always thinking of this. If someone's trying to like defeat you, you can use your C skill, right? To stun him and use your scented kicks to run. <laughs> Next time, did you notice I'm always thinking of ways how to run from enemies? <laughs> okay, so that's it guys for all the skills. I really love this fruit, to be honest. Better than the previous fruits. Even better than, I guess... I don't know, oh, yeah. the Awakened Magma and the Buddha Fruit is still better for me. But again guys, I love this fruit comparing it to the previous fruits that are not Awakened. So for the final test, we are gonna defeat Diamond with this fruit only. This fruit only. So is it hard guys? Uh, the minimum level to challenge this with a quest is 750. But we're gonna try and defeat this. So we're just gonna cycle our skills. Dash Dash, first skill. Second skill, there you go, scented kicks, there you go, again first skill, the third skill, and we're just gonna cycle guys. We're not gonna spend the, all our observation hockey with just one combo, we're gonna dash, dash, dash. That's why we add some, they call this melee, right? Okay. Guys, I think we can defeat this. We're just gonna speed this up. Even without observation hockey, I guess. Because we keep on dodging. There you go, second skill. And the enemy is almost done. So that's it, guys, for the video. Do you like the love fruit? Guys, for me, I like it. Better, again, better than the other fruits. How about you guys? Do you like it? Comment it on the comment section. So again, tomorrow I'm gonna post a video, Venom and Door Fruit. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is Gamer Nom. See you tomorrow, guys. And Gamer Nom out.